Hello, Carl here with Sustainability Theory News. We're over at deepgreenpermaculture.com, and they have a good article on crop rotation systems for annual vegetables. And I'm going to put another article in a moment on crop rotation in spin farming, which they call relay systems. But they have a pretty good art, uh, graphic here, year one, year two, year three, and bed one, bed two, bed three, and shows how you want to start with some tomatoes and some roots, then some legumes. And they do that again. Roots, fruits, legumes. They just rotate it out. But they do it on a three-year system. So under spin farming, they would do it in one year. They call it crop relaying. And uh, this is a fairly new article from earlier in 2016. It puts the cool season crop family, spinach, chard, beets, lettuces, onions, garlics, warm season crops, nightshades, peppers, and tomatoes, that sort of thing. And uh, curcurbits, I believe that's uh, squash and cucumbers. Uh, legume family, which are beans and uh, peanuts. All sorts of trees are leguminous as well. And they fix nitrogen from the atmosphere and rebuild the soil. And there's another article here that you might want to check out on relays explaining how three or more crops are grown in the same plot throughout the growing season. And maybe they'll have the cool season, the warm season, the cool season again. And maybe a winter cover crop to round it out. Uh, Curtis Stone, urban farmer, great man on YouTube, does four. He does fruits, roots, legumes, and uh, then uh, just a grain. Uh, or greens, I'm sorry, not grain, greens. And then he just rotates that out. But you want to read more about it, you can follow the links in the description. And if you'd like to see more news headlines like this, subscribe to my channel. Have a great day.